what's going on you guys welcome back to another video i want to talk about one of the most used smear tactics that narcissists use and that smear tactic is to just flat out lie on you and tell people that you don't like them and it dawned on me that this is the reason why i would often get these uh you know stares at work which is a part of the gang stalking because if she has um told this to so many people these people will at some point start to look at you a certain way either they're frowned up or roll their eyes at you or just don't really have any conversation for you and that's really fine to me about the conversation part but as far as the smearing these people have been lied to and i think it, i owe it to them to let them know that they've been lied to and uh, all that you've heard about me is a lie and then from that point on they can do whatever they want to do with their information now as far as the narcissist her main goal is to get a reaction out of me by smearing my name lying and telling these people that i don't like them i'm not going to give her that reaction however i will let these people know that i know that it's all a part of her mind games just to make me you know look bad it's all a part of her punishment because we are no longer friends and she don't know how to accept that so you know she's going to continue to do things like this but again i feel like i owe it to them just to let them know and to clear my name i don't have anything against you and that's that and i feel like i owe that to them because we have to work together you know and to make work more productive you should want to be in a more comfortable you know workplace and that makes the workplace more comfortable and more productive if you know that you can you can stand working with people so i know that this is what they do to smear your name and you get these reactions from these people because of the narcissist not because how they really feel about you they're going by something that she has um uh, put in their minds so just to kind of play the game right along with her just let the people know that you you know you don't have nothing against them and that'll be the end of that now this smearing can also cause gang stalking and this gang stalking is all of these people will some people they handle situations different to where it is they won't just ignore the fact that somebody has an issue with them they will harass the person some people will and some won't which causes the gang stalking some of them will just stare you down and give you an ugly look and you will be wondering like why are they looking at me like that what's her problem and the whole while this is all a part of the narcissist plan you know so this is all of this is caused because of the narcissist um what else did i want to talk about i can sometimes think about things that we talked about which now lets me know that she has done this to other people in the past and i know the person who she's done it to because she used to always say we need to all just sit her down and tell her we know what it is that you're doing and so that you know when i think about that now i'm like I know that you were behind, you know, what you're doing, what you did to her. You're behind what's happening with me now with these people. You're behind these people. You're the cause of these people, you know, coming having an issue with me now. You're causing this issue between me and these people. And so I need to let them know individually that you're the cause of this. You're the one who's spreading these, these lies about me so like i said that's one of the most used smear tactics that they use and that is to tell other people that you don't like them i mean if somebody tell you that somebody doesn't like you you're going to react to it one way or the other you're going to be like well i don't know why i never done her anything you're going to immediately um become defensive against these false claims or whatever or maybe they true i don't know or you're going to want to confront them about it. Or if you don't confront them about it, you're going to let them know through your actions. Well, since you have a problem with me, then I don't want to have anything to do with you. 
And, you know, that'll give a person, you know, that'll kind of let them know that something has been said. Like somebody must have told you something about me because you acting a different way. You acting funny. Yesterday, you know, we had a good time working together. It was all laughs, you know, just all good in the workplace. And then now today, I just get a whole nother. And sometimes people, you know, they're not the same every day. I'm not the same every day. It all depends on my mood, but I'm not going to treat you differently. And so you kind of know when a narcissist is behind this dirty work by the way people start treating you. If they just suddenly out the blue start treating you funny or, you know, like just very defensive about anything, you can kind of know that I cleared my name yesterday to someone and they kind of gave me an ear full on the fact that she said something about me and I know that she said it to other people. So, you know, to just to clear my name on this, I'm not done with it. Next week, because I haven't been around a narcissist the last two days, I work somewhere else. But where I was yesterday, this person let me know that because I was wondering why, like, what's your issue with me? And they're like, what's your issue with me? Because I was told... And that's how I know. I had always known this. I always had that in the back of my mind that she's probably telling these people I don't like them and all kind of stuff. It's just, you know, I don't put nothing past a narcissist when they're trying to punish you, when they try to get a reaction on you. But she will never know. I will never give her the satisfaction of knowing that I know what she's doing. She'll know when they bring this information back to her because I'm pretty sure they're going to let her know. Well, she told me that you lied. And what else can she do with it? I'm going to give them the whole rundown and let them know, look, she lying because I don't want to be friends with her no more. So this is something that people do because they don't know how to handle rejection. You know, they're going to lie on you. Or they're going to try to just do all type of things to make you look bad. And, you know, so I'm just going to let them know. I don't have nothing against you. I can work with anybody, you know, so... That's pretty much all I want to say in this video about narcissists and the most used smear tactic is to tell people that you don't like them. So anyway, y'all leave y'all comments down below on this video. Let me know if you've had experienced something like this before, especially in the workplace. And I should be back later on today with a movie review. And, um... If you stay tuned, you'll find out what it is. So thank y'all for watching. Talk to you soon.